Happy Easter to you, Skip. Happy Easter to you, too. You son of a gun. Both of us graduated from the University of Iowa, and they're here covering it here today. Yes, and, go, go Astros, go Hawks. You bet. And, and my son said we've already been on the Hawkeye website, so we're going to stick together all year, aren't we? Yes, we are. There'll be a lot of Hawks here today cheering us on, too. I, I understand. you got a lot of friends, and everybody's coming to see you in your debut as a skipper. Yes, sir. Yeah! Boy, when you think back, as you were a star at Iowa, both in football and baseball, played minor league ball, got a cup of coffee in the big leagues, but somewhere along the line, you kind of knew that managing was what you wanted to do. It was definitely something that I thought about. I always played the game in its entirety, thinking about all aspects. I never just worried about just my position. And I was very blessed and very fortunate to play for some great managers and some great coaches as far as football go. And, you know, they kind of set me down, you know, midway. And it's just like, listen, when you're done with this, you have an opportunity to stay in this game. So it's something that I started thinking long and hard about. And um, in 2005, decided to go the coaching route and extremely blessed and honored to be the manager of the Houston Astros today. And this bow is for you. Wish him well in his Thank debut you tonight. No one can come to my house because it's full. So <laughs> you would have to find a, a, a nearby hotel someplace. Um, no, we will have a lot. I'll have a lot of family and friends here. Um, a lot of my college teammates, you know, they've come. They've come into town. A lot of several of them surprised me. Some of them, you know, came in, you know, yesterday. Some more will come in today. It's um, it's always you. You always feel honored when you have, you know, special people that are part of your life. They've been a part of your life for a long time, and they get an opportunity to um, come out and support. It's, um, it always makes you feel good inside when you get that kind of support. But my wife would be here, my mom and dad would be here, my son would be here, um, my grandmother, my aunts and my uncles from New Jersey, um, my aunts and uncles from Dallas. My wife has a lot of family, you know, that's, that lives here because she, you know, she's born and raised here. The number of people that we will have here, I pretty much cannot even tell you because I'll let my wife handle it. I, I pretty much just put it out of my hair and just said, I don't want to deal with it. You um, make sure everybody get to the game and have a good time. You want to get to the back, read the fight of the ball, and then let the fight of the ball tell you what to do. It was emotional for me a little bit. I'm so proud of them. I mean, you know, to be one of the 32 teams, the 30 teams, uh, uh, you know, the first or the youngest African American coach ever. Um, a, a game that I love in baseball to watch, and then to see all my family, all the friends, uh, his family as well. So uh, this is special, extra, extra special for me to be able to witness. The manager in Major League Baseball is unbelievable. It's a great feeling, great feeling. Happy for him. You seem like yesterday I met him with an 18-year-old kid out of Newark, New Jersey, you know, weighing 155 pounds, and now he's here, part of the big show. It's, it's awesome. It's a good feeling. It's fantastic. You know, we had a good time to get the families together last night and uh, celebrate this momentous occasion and Stacy's 40th birthday, and it's good to have our kids and his, and his child and all of us here, it's like a big family reunion, so it's fun. We're excited. You know, it's always good when, you're, when your friends and your family, they come out and they share, you know, moments like this and they support you. So I was, just, you know, very happy to have a lot of my friends and family here tonight to share in this occasion. And um, it's, it feels good. But at the same time, like I said earlier today, this is one of 162, and on Tuesday we're going to tee it up again, and we're going to come with the same energy.